Hey y'all, I hope you all had an amazing holiday season. I know that I did. I got a lot of opportunities to relax, spend time with friends and family, all those things, got a little shopping in. But let me tell you, if you are like me and you like buying Christmas decor the day after Christmas, then I got a treat for you. Stay tuned. Hey, so I want to thank my subscribers, uh, my supporters, you know, for supporting me. Uh, I appreciate that. For those who are new here, uh, I hope you like the content. Uh, please, you know, subscribe and join on in. And if you have any recommendations, you know, then please share. Okay, well, let's get into it. So I was scrolling online the other day and I ran across a video and this lady had all this really cute Valentine's Day, you know, decor. Now, I don't usually decorate for Valentine's Day, but let me tell you, it was such a cute item that I had to get up and go to Hobby Lobby. So, let me show you real quick. Give me a second. So, I was looking at a video from someone, and she was showing all this cute Valentine's Day decor. And I saw this cute little gingerbread house. Like, how cute is that? I was like, oh my God, I want one. I, you know, I love all things pink and it's sparkly. And it does have an LED light. So it was super cute. Um, $11.99 and it had like 40% off when I went to the store. Okay. And the other thing that I saw was this cute little um, mug, you know. It's just a cute little thing. I mean, you can just decorate with it. You know, I just liked it. And this was $6.99 and they had 40% off. Well, as you would guess, I ended up buying a few more things that they had. Like I got some, like, some cute dish towels. Um, I got like some other little knickknacks that, had, that were for Valentine's Day. But as I was walking through the store, I saw that they had 90% off on the Christmas stuff. Now, the first aisle I went to, there wasn't a whole lot. So I was like, okay, this is cool. I just kind of looked at what they had, and I picked up a few things. But let me tell you, if you are about representation, you know, you know, as black people, um, we, it's hard to find like Christmas decor, like Santa Clauses and all of that with our skin tone, with that melanin skin tone, right? So I will tell you this Christmas season, I was pretty uh, fortunate to find some different things that had my skin complexion. So let me show you these mugs that I found. I'm not gonna show you all of them. I got four, but I'm gonna show you like two of them so you get an idea. Okay, I know I left my cabinet open, but I'm gonna put this stuff back. Anyway, so they had this cute, you know, Mrs. Claus um, coffee mug, and they had it with the eyes open and the eyes closed. So this mug was, um, I think it was like $10.99. And so I got it for 90% off. So I paid like a dollar and 10 cent, you know? So I went ahead and got both sets. Here's the, the Mr. Claus, right? With his eyes closed. And I got him with the eyes closed and open. I got this set, right? But I said for a dollar and 10 cent, I said I need to let people know about this. Because you know, with, um, you know, where I'm in South Texas, you know, there's a lot more Hispanic people here, right? And um, so a lot of um, our, you know, items that are for the, for, you know, for black people tend to end up being on clearance. So I actually went to another store. I went to like TJ Maxx um, the day after Christmas. They had like the Santa Claus there, like 50% off. It was like five of them. So I, I bought one. As a matter of fact, let me show you what that looked like. Give me a second. So I got this little guy, 50% uh, off at the um, Home Goods CJ Maxx. Yeah, I had to pay like $10 for him. And I mean, you know, very nice size, you know? Super cute. I was like, oh my God, like, I, I hardly ever see, you know, Santa Claus with melanin. 
but I had to go ahead and purchase this when I saw it, okay? But yeah, and so I got him in like the silver outfit. Also, I got one with him in the gold, and they had one with him in like red. So you know what? If you think you're too late to buy Christmas stuff, let me tell you, they probably still have some. So yeah, you might wanna do that. Okay. All right, I'm back. So from Hobby Lobby, I was going down the aisles, so I recognized there were other aisles that still had Christmas stuff. So I went down them, and then I found this cute little um, guy here, another Santa Claus, okay? And 90% off. So it's $39.99, so I, I spent like $4 for him. Now, this is a tree topper, but I mean, you can, it's still sturdy enough to let it stand on its own, like on your, you know, on your dining room table, on the end table, whatever. But I was like, for $4, I mean, I cannot beat this. Like, oh my God, you know? Super cute. You know, I love the red and then the little detail, the little bell on the bottom. $4. Okay, I'm gonna put him here. Then, I saw this beautiful angel, okay? I was like, oh my God. And the, you know, and this angel was $34.99. And so I got this for like, you know, $3.50. And the most beautiful, you know, gold ensemble, right? And I said, this is also a tree topper, but you know, you can put it, you can let it, you know, you know, you can let it just stand on its own. So I was like, oh my God. I could not believe that they still had like this kind of stuff in the um in the home goods. And I just went in there on this past Tuesday. So on January the second. So I'm here to tell you, you know, if you still want to find a few things, check them out this weekend and see what they have. They just marked everything down to 90%, I was told, on this past um, Tuesday. So I came on the right day. So let me tell you what else I got. I mean, I got all kind of um, ornaments. I mean, I got kind of with the burlap. I got like, you know, the kind that are like pretty, you know, glittery and, and gold and all that. And I mean, I got a plethora of stuff. But let me show you these ornaments I got, okay? I got... So I got this case of ornaments, and I think it's like, you know, uh, 50 that you get in here. And these are regular price, uh, like $19.99. Yeah, they're also they were regular price, $15.98, okay? And so I got these ornaments for like $1.60. So I bought like four different sets. So I bought, you know, the blue color scheme, and I also bought like a, a white color scheme, you know? I mean, for a dollar and 60 cents, why not? Now, I thought I was doing some big things. I bought some ornaments from Walmart um, for like $10. But I never thought I would be able to find ornaments of this quality for a dollar and 60 cents, okay? So let me put this here. So yeah. So yeah, I just wanted to share with you all that the Hobby Lobby still has some cute stuff in the store. Now, this is not any kind of a sponsored um, video or anything, but I was, you know what? I was in the store literally surprised that they still had that much stuff in the store at 90% off, okay? And I ended up buying a total of, I think, 42 items. Um, and there were some Valentine's Day things. You know, I did buy a few Valentine's Day things, but the majority was for Christmas. And I only paid like $83, okay? On the receipt, it said I saved like $371, okay? So anyway, I'm not trying to entice anybody, you know, to buy any more Christmas stuff, but baby, if you would like to, you know, you know, update your Christmas decor and get ready for our 2024 season, or even if you're planning on doing like a Christmas tree, really that's for Easter or Mardi Gras, or having one, you know, set up year round. Like I wanna do a pink tree 
year round. I'm thinking about it. Um, I literally bought like five Christmas trees on Christmas Day online. And I got them on sale. Like I got trees for like $18, $20, 50 bucks, and 90. That's how I got the five. So I may do a tree in my in my um, you know in my glam room area, but I haven't decided yet. So it never hurts to have ornaments because you know doing the garlands and all that, you need different ornaments and different colors and sizes. And it's always nice to already have stuff instead of having to go buy it. And I mean for a dollar sixty, you can't go wrong. But anyway, um, just wanted to kind of pop in, show you what I found at the Hobby Lobby. Um, you know, I hope you enjoyed this little chit chat with me. Um, please like, share, subscribe, and comment. And um, hopefully I will catch you on the next video. Bye. I just got in a whole brand new bag. I'm running around like I missed it. Elliot, jewelry moving like juice. He's talking about gold and they hit me. Look, I just leveled up, I thank God.